With the Bison football fall season postponed, senior offensive lineman Dylan Radins has come to terms with the fact that he's played his final season as a Bison. The 6'6", 300-pound left tackle has a shot at the NFL, and while he knows he won't be here this spring, he says he isn't going anywhere just yet. Dylan Radins hasn't cleaned out his Bison locker just yet. As of now, I am still Bison. I'm working on training and stuff like that. Uh, we don't have a plan laid out completed yet. Part of that is the clarification still needed from the NCAA. NDSU and every program is waiting for details and plans about how they can proceed with the fall still. Bison head football coach Matt Enns speaking Monday referenced the frustration and waiting for those answers. Uh, unfortunately, we won't get that information probably till later this week. I cannot sign with an agent until after college my football season is over. So that's where the gray area comes here because it's like my football season's over, um, but I'm pursuing my academic career and that's what I want to finish first. For Raidens, it is about protecting his scholarship and getting his education, meaning he hasn't signed with an agent yet. He's doing his homework, interviewing agents, talking to former Bison, and picking the brains of his coaches. But until the NCAA provides a clear answer, Raiden says he won't sign anything. So I'm not going to sign on that dotted line if you're going to take my scholarship away because my academics is more important than going and training somewhere because I can just stay here and train with Kramer anyway. Raidens is set to graduate in December and says he'll wait to sign till then if he needs to. While the particulars need clarification from the NCAA, the support remains from his Bison coaches. Raidens will return to campus later this week and says he plans to work with his teammates and help the future of the program in any way he can while he also prepares himself for the next step. I'm going to do whatever the coaches need me to do, but ultimately they're looking out what's best for me. So if I can go train somewhere else, they're going to allow me to do that. They're going to honor my scholarship still. We have plenty more from this conversation with Dylan Radins on our VNL News app. As for those answers he's waiting on, he could get them as early as Friday when the NCAA Board of Governors is set to meet. Another